All right, the last framework we're going to talk about is called ISO 27000, ISO 27000 series. So ISO is an organization in Switzerland. It maintains standards, international standards, for lots of different things. Uh, everything from the currency codes that we use across the world uh, to U.S., or not U.S., but to country codes, uh, all kinds of different codes. Uh, some of you, uh, again, pointing to the CME folks, may have heard or even uh, have uh, talked about the ISO 9000 series, which is a total quality management and a continuous improvement quality standard that a lot of organizations use, especially if you've heard of uh, Six Sigma. Six Sigma organizations tend to focus on ISO 9000 delivery. But getting back to ISO 27000, the ISO 27000 series focuses specifically on information security. All right. The main ones are 27001 and 002. So these are the most recognized information security frameworks around the world. Again, this is something that can work in conjunction with the other frameworks. So you could have COSO and then say, well, we want to bring in ISO 27000 to bring a little bit more detail to what we're doing with regard to information security. So ISO 27000, very narrow in its focus. Information security uh, goes very deep in that topic area. And like with uh, many IT frameworks and methodologies, this one does focus a life uh, on a life cycle approach. Here you can see they've got um, assessment, uh, implementing the controls, what are treatment plans, uh, etc. All right, so that uh, is a quick tour of three of the other frameworks that you are likely to run across uh, when it comes time to do your controls review. So hopefully this helps you get started.